hey youtube and welcome back to it's amazing if you are new to my channel hello welcome my name is kaylin and if you're a returning subscriber like welcome back to here we've missed you so if you are new to my channel and this is your first time seeing my chocolate face you see the red button make it great and subscribe and join the terry squad wait i said that wrong and join the family terry because we're almost 700 deep and you can get us there and Hit the bell notification while you're already down there and don't forget to follow me on my social media accounts which will be floating up above just for you so yeah i'm about to stretch my hair so let's just get right into the video i do my hair toss check my nails baby how you feeling hair toss check my nails baby how you feeling okay so if you've seen my other video where i showed you how i take down my twist you already know like why my hair is looking like this but if you have not watched the video yet it's in the description box go click it watch that one before you watch this one because it will make so much more sense or you can click it up here in the you know little thingy that floats up but yeah so i'm going to be showing you how i stretch my hair with minimum frizz and maximum length because like this is cute and whatnot, but I like my hair big and I like my problems small. So we're about to stretch this hair and, you know, put some volume to her. So the first thing I'm going to do is stretch it. Now, I normally do not advocate using blow dryers, but this is going to try, I'm trying to make this a quick process. So I will be using the blow dryer today, but I did use some oil on my hair. I don't have, I didn't use any heat protectant because like, I feel like the oil is a barrier too, you know, cause the heat protectant is just a barrier over the hair so it won't burn. So I feel like oil can do the same thing, but if it doesn't, I'll just get heat damage. But anyway, so I'm going to be using my blow dryer to stretch my hair first. And to start off, I'm going to be starting at the back and working my way up. And I'm going to start on this piece right here. So I'm going to be taking my blow dryer and I use the highest setting because I want it to stretch faster. But you can use lower settings if you want to, but it will take longer to stretch. So all I'm going to do is get this section of my hair and hold it down. And I'm going to be doing, I'm not going to be really spraying, spraying. I'm not going to really be putting the blow dryer down. I'm really going to focus it at my root so I can elongate that part and still have my defined curls at the bottom. And as you can see, like it is a drastic difference from when I first started. Like this portion is more stretched, but I still have my definition at the ends. So I'm gonna show you one more time what I do. And then we're just gonna fast forward and stretch this entire half. So like before I'm gonna take I'm gonna take these off first. Then I'm going to be taking a medium section. This this big, my hair. Pinning the wrists out of the way. Then take the section, pull it taut, and pull it down. And then get my blow dryer and put it on the highest one it can do. And tilt it downward so it can, you know, blow downward onto the hair. And just um, stretch it like that basically and this is your result like stretched twists and like it kind of looks funny up this way but once you start laying the hair on top you're not going to notice that all the ends are just going to be showing and they're just going to look so much better and like as you can see like it's it's a drastic difference from this so so i'm just going to do the rest of my hair i'm going to come back when i'm done with this entire section and i will show you like what I am working with and how she's doing so yeah enjoy this non copyrighted music I'm back and this is how my hair is looking after I stretched all of this side and like I know y'all see this length the lymphoid diff is that a mama ma it's lymphoid word never mind so when I'm done stretching it with the warm 
air I like to put it on cool and just blast the section I don't know I just feel like it seals everything in so I do it and so this is how the section is looking after I just stretched it and like you can't even tell that I didn't go all the way down to the ends because they look good and this part is just stretched. So yeah, so I'm just going to do the other section off camera and I will be back when my entire head is done. I'm going to tell you this black girl magic whether you want it or not. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I am back and we're doing a voiceover. So yes, the hair looks elongated. It looks fluffy. It looks beautiful. But... We still have a little work to do. I like to shape my hair because, you know, I do DIY trims. So, <clears throat> my length is a little off. So, all I'm going to do is just taking a bobby pin. And I am going to pull my hair down and, like, pin it in place. So, I can pin it at the length that I like it. And then, I'm just going to fluff the hair on top out. So that that is my trick to make my hair stay as elongated as it is during the day and to just shape it more because like I said DIY trims and I'm going to be doing this all over my hair so yeah. After I'm done with that, I'm going to be taking my good old pick and I am going to be, you know, fluffing out the hair, making the hair big and the problem small. And I do this, you know, until I feel like it looks good. <laughs> and yeah, these are my final results and they look pretty bomb if I do say so myself. Okay, if you made it this far into the video, like, comment, I don't know, uh, <laughs> pink shoulders, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, so these are my results, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up, and do not forget to comment, like, and of course, subscribe. And if you want to see more of my chocolate face, hit the bell notification so you will be updated every time I upload and follow me on my social media sites to get the inside scoop of all things I do with my hair and I'll see you guys in the next one bye